Weasel News. What's up, deputies? Officer First 30 Minutes here. Today we're doing a first ever Coast Guard Patrol. So it's going to be a little different than the uh, real duties of a Coast Guard in real life. Let me just read you real quick what law enforcement duties the Coast Guard has. So the United States Coast Guard is the nation's leading maritime law enforcement agency and has broad, multifaceted jurisdictional authority. So the specific statutory authority for the Coast Guard law enforcement mission is given in 14 U.S.C. 2. The Coast Guard shall enforce or assist in the enforcement of all applicable laws on, under, and over the high seas and waters subject to the jurisdiction of the United States. In addition, 14 U.S.C. 89 provides authority for U.S. Coast Guard's active duty commissioned warrant and petty officers to enforce applicable U.S. laws. It authorizes Coast Guard personnel to enforce federal law on water subject to U.S. jurisdiction and in that international waters as well as on all vessels subject to U.S. jurisdiction, including U.S. foreign and stateless vessels. So typically, uh, Coast Guard, they would just, you know, enforce like uh, boats on the water around the coast, but since there are no boat call-outs, we'll be doing call-outs on Del Perro Beach instead. So this is uh, the model I'm using. We're going to be having a life vest on, even though we're not going to be in the ocean. Looks pretty sweet. Uh, we'll have all normal powers of arresting people and uh, using deadly force if need be. This is the 2015 Suburban we're using, decked out in uh, Coast Guard decals. So it should be a fun patrol, and uh, let's do it. Citizens report a possible stolen vehicle in Vespucci Beach. Okay, we got a possible stolen vehicle on the beach. We're going to go ahead and respond to this one. I see him. He's driving all over the beach right now. All right, dispatch. Got a visual on the uh, tracked vehicle. Attention all units. Gauging in pursuit. Like the vehicle is not going to stop. It's a uh, silver colored Monroe. Plate number is 24 November India Papa 139. Oh, they just broke through a bunch of fences. We'll get local jurisdiction um, to go ahead and respond to this. Oh, yeah. All right. We're going to have to put a stop to this. He's driving through. Um, oh, my gosh. He just caught a ton of air, almost landed on someone. We're going to be escalating this chase because he's putting people's lives at risk here on the beach by just running through everything. Well, I'm going to request a pit as soon as I get closer. Just ran through some brush. Looks like he's headed to the roads now. So requesting the pit. That is the correct vehicle. I'm running every over everything myself. Backup being slow once again. Had it uh, eastbound on West Eclipse Boulevard. Trying to block him in here. All right, he's out of the car. He's running. He's on foot. Dispatch. He is on foot. We're headed southbound on West Eclipse Boulevard. I'm seeing backup coming on scene here. He's a uh, black male, looks like a purple and white jacket, jeans. We are on a foot pursuit. Calling two more uh, additional units for backup here. Okay, we might got him. He's been tased, he's been tased. LSPD providing the assistance here. Awesome, awesome. Good work, guys. I'm gonna see if his vehicle's still out here while that uh, officer makes the arrest. If so, we'll go ahead and search it. So yeah, I got a lot of comments. People telling me not to use the body camera again, and I don't plan on using that. Um, camera view anymore it was just kind of a test to see the mod and Albo himself told me you know it's not really um, used to actually play because 
it's you know the controls are so jerky but i wanted to try it so thanks for everyone for watching that video gives a little perspective on what a body camera is and how it works no i don't want to search the suburban okay we're searching the engine compartment now nothing of interest yeah this car got pretty damaged there so let's see if we can do the driver's side door now and then we'll get it towed off just found some forged ID cards looks like the engine actually might be in the back of this vehicle something smoking back there all right let's go ahead and get it towed get a tow truck out here always love using this 2015 Suburban I think it looks awesome all right, tow truck's coming. It's that red unit right there. Let's go ahead, hop back in the Suburban, and we'll head back to Del Perro Beach. We have a wanted felon on the loose in Del Perro Beach. Target is on foot. All right, we got Josh Stewart, wanted for extortion. He's actually on the beach, so I'm going to try to verify that he's out here, and then I'm going to move in to make an arrest. We have been warned that he is armed and dangerous. Okay, he's running. We got a runner. Suspect is um, in red shirt, lighter colored uh, long pants. We're headed on the pier now. Get my gun out. All right. So called in two additional backup units. This guy is quick. Everybody always wants to run. So we were warned he is armed and dangerous, so we need to take that into account here. But I'm pretty sure this pier dead ends up here, so I don't think he'll be able to get much further. I hear backup behind me. Also guys, while we're chasing him, I will mention, let's go ahead and pull the taser out. Oh, missed. Taze missed. Dang it. Okay, uh, we got another officer. Hopefully they'll do a good job blocking him off. Nope. Oh yeah, Taze was effective. Awesome. Good work, guys. Oh, dispatch suspect is dead. Apparently that Taze killed him. What are the chances? That was crazy. I've never seen that happen. Okay, so as I was saying, live stream is planned tomorrow. I've been working with Snow and HD to get LSPDFR online working, and we've kind of got it working. Um, I'm going to see if he's available tomorrow, and we'll try to do a stream of that. Let's go ahead and get the corner out. I think it's a lot of fun. We were testing out call outs and custom car packs. Um, it's a lot to get set up because, oh, what, oh man, I was, I thought this guy was about to pull out a gun, but he just pulled out his phone to take a picture. Here comes the corner running everyone over. Oh, okay. We got shots fired. Oh no, we're firing at the corner for some reason. For some reason we are shooting the corner. All right, let's not shoot the corner. Let's not shoot the corner. Let him do his job. Okay. Okay. Well, the <laughs> this other corner is ready to take the picture, but you just killed the other one. I have no re I have no idea why they do that sometimes. They see the corner is hostile. So we're going to have to recall in the corner, it looks like. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about your buddy, man. All right, so <laughs> this corner might be glitched. So we'll call it code four from here and continue our patrol. Citizens reporting a serious MVA and Vespucci Beach. All right, we got a road traffic collision. Apparently it's pretty serious according to dispatch. So we're gonna go ahead and see what's going on here. Make sure everybody's okay. I don't know how all these cars are getting on the beach. So I'm seeing uh, two vehicles. Actually, one is 
lodged under the lifeguard stand. So uh, show us on scene. Okay, let's go ahead and talk to the driver. This lady is actually stuck under there. We'll get a plate check first. So it's an ingot, 2-8, uh, Quebec, Kilo, uniform 0 two, two, two. that's 2-8, two, Quebec, two, eight, Kilo, two, uniform two, zero, two, two. Zero, two, two, no, 10 Okay, no flag, so let's go ahead and talk to the driver here. So let's check for injuries, of course. She says she can't move, so that's not too good. Let's get a statement. I'm not sure what happened. Okay. She says she can't move, but then she got out of the vehicle, so that's a little suspicious. Let's get that ID from her and Just run her name and everything. Kim Orange. What a good name. Kim Orange. So, Miss Orange, license is valid, no active warrants, okay. So let me go ahead and talk to the other driver here. Play check. So yeah, obviously Coast Guard wouldn't really be involved in these type of callouts, but as soon as we get boat callouts, I will be happy to do a uh, more official Coast Guard patrol. David Felony Sam warrant for registered four, owner. Okay. So we're going to check for injuries. Might have broken a bone. Let's get a statement. What? I hit someone. Okay. Um, we're going to go ahead and get her ID. See if she's a registered owner. If so, we're going to be arresting her because she has a warrant out. This is why it's always a good idea to check IDs because you never know who has warrants. Jolie Seuss is her name. Yep, so she is wanted. We're going to go ahead and uh, make an arrest here. Asshole. All right, hands up, ma'am. You're under arrest. You get a warrant out for your name. Wow. She's wanted by LSPD. So we'll make that arrest, and we will go ahead and call in prisoner transport since uh, we're not even the... Holy the agency that wants her, but we will do a pat down first. Oh, we found drugs, a forged ID card, and shaved keys. Wow, a whole bunch of stuff. Calling that transport. Search this vehicle, and then I'll get to the other lady. I actually think the other lady was probably at fault in this accident. Um. Cause she is pinned under the hell, uh, the lifeguard stand, but we'll, we'll check. So forged ID cards, we're finding all s types of stuff. She's going to be receiving quite a few charges. Nothing. Nice. Okay. So let's get the tow truck. And then let's go ahead, continue talking to this other lady. So, um, her car is not going to be drivable since all the uh, glass is broken out. So I'm going to tell her to leave on foot and we're going to tow her vehicle and insurance will handle the rest of this. So she can leave and we'll get a tow truck out here for this car. All right, tow truck's taking away one. Got another one coming to take away this one. And that concludes this call out. All right, guys, I think I'm going to end the patrol here for today. Oh, I'm breaking into my own car. I got to look into that. Seems like I'm getting walked out of my car a lot. As always, leave your suggestions down in the comment section below. I always read through those. And I'll see you guys on the next patrol.